What time it is real quick? 10.03. 10.03. You just gave me the time. Mm. How much that cost me? Free. <laughs> but free, right? Yeah. So what the f I'm paying $100,000 for a watch for? What's your first three picks in fantasy football this year? Damn, I don't even play fantasy. Ah. Uh. Well, shoot, number one. I was trying to get it inside. Uh -huh. <laughs> <For my life. laughs> What's the dumbest thing y'all boys ever spent y'all money on? I got too many. I ain't gonna lie, strip club. I ain't gonna lie. Check me out, man. When is the right time to move a girl in? No. Uh -uh. When right y'all get married? To move a girl? No, you dating people, especially here in Miami. Oh, I need 300 for my hair. No, you don't. I got you. <laughs> no, you come on, come over here. Come I on got you. Got to oversee. I got you. I, I can I can do your install. I can break what you want. Yeah, it probably was harder to get sex back then. Though, what? Back no. Then? What? No. I think it's easier no. now. Hey. No. Yeah, I think it's easier now. Welcome to the Fly Stoner Podcast. It's your boy Fly Stoner Motor kicking it with the Stoner Crew. You feel me? Back up in this bitch, man. I know y'all see the orange wall. We in the studio today. Yeah, man. Don't worry about it. I got the guns out. We safe today. Got the guns out, man. Don't worry. It's on safe. What Trina said, toot, 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 toot. <laughs> <laughs> toot, 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 toot. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, this shit on safety, man. This 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 the Glocks right here, man. Oh my Nigga god. Nigga look like a WNBA player. Oh god, <laughs> hey, yeah, nah, nah, nah. You capped out, boy. Damn. You hear me, y'all boy? You hear me? That boy on WWE mode right hey, now, man. man. Creator wrestler. Oh. Yeah, man. You we got that shirt like that? Yeah, <laughs> boy. Yeah. Oh, it's that god speed, sure. bro. bro. That's his new just drip sure now, bro. Bathroom, he got bro. every color. It's that god speed. Nah, I got, I got, I got me one more. I got me one more on the tuck. You feel me? I'm gonna bring out. So you got three of them. <laughs> yeah, I got three of them. Damn. I got three of them. Damn. Nigga looking at that shit in the stone said, "Y'all finna buy this." Yeah, I'm like, yeah, boy. I'm finna buy this. Yeah, boy. Buy this shit. Yeah, boy. Yeah, man. We got Smalls in the building. Nah, free base, man. I'm free base. Mind them free base. Yes, I sire. We got Cole Jack in the building. Yo, 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 you know what it is. Cole, man, how you feeling today? You feeling good, man. I feel good about this episode right here. You okay, heard? okay, okay, okay. We got JP behind the controls. Family, what they do? Yes, sir, <laughs> man. We got a very special guest up in the building today. We got the one, the only, Ocho. Ocho, Ocho the Cinco. I'm just happy. Yes, yeah, sir. I'm just happy you niggas got me out the house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy you got me out the house. That's real. Now I appreciate you for coming. Nah, most definitely, real, most definitely. Nah. I ain't, ain't too many times I really be be out the house past nine o'clock. Yeah, real. So to have a reason to come out, you know, <laughs> and you ain't gonna understand unless you're married. Yeah, I appreciate y'all. <laughs> he said, "Hey, you sitting nah, there I feel that though, man. Yeah, no, yeah no, hey, man. I feel that though. My girl, my girl, my girl. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. I'm out the house. Yeah, and I ain't going back. I'm not gonna say though. You got a, you got a reason to be out the house though. Like, yeah. once you out, hey, yeah. it's on the flow. Yeah, I'm, I'm out now. I'm in these streets mm -hmm. <laughs> until he gets sleepy. Until you get that call." <laughs> Young guys, man, them young guys, man, the dude was telling them about, man. That's how you go when you go back home, bro. I'm telling you, them young cats, man. He like, boy, how you know, I'm telling you, young niggas, man, stay, man, keep the head up, man. <laughs> yeah, man, but for this show, our first 10, 15 minutes, we always do our little amateur journalistic duties, you feel yes, me? Yes, sir. So for the first five, t well, for the people who don't know, who is Ocho Cinco? Hold on. Damn, they don't know? They got to know, but they, if they I mean, don't they know. know. You feel me? Obviously, if they clicked on, but just for the people who don't know, it's probably that small percentage. Of I mean, for the percentage know. that don't know, I'm Ocho. I'm at the city. Yeah. I'm at the 40s. Yeah. <laughs> yeah really nice. Original. 305 uh -huh. representer. Uh, that was a crazy story. I grew up in the 80s. Always wanted to be a rattler and go to fam. What? Always. What? Plot Always. twist. <laughs> oh, oh, he didn't want to go to UL? Uh, who? Nah. He didn't want to go to UL? Man, I wanted to go to fam. That boy said he wanted to go to fam. My grandma, my grandma and my mama wanted to cook me, right? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. So every year they took me to the classic. I never forget. I went to the classic since 1984. Every year. Mm -hmm. I ain't want to go. I'm crying. I ain't what I got to go for. And going to that game, even though they went to cook me, I gravitated toward that. That orange and green. Yeah. That's that now, type hey, of listen, I wanted to be in the band. That boy said I wanted to be. And I wanted to be in the band. Woman. I wanted to be a drum major. 
never had the opportunity to do so. Obviously, high school, I was I was a knucklehead. I was supposed to be at the West. Mm-hmm. Remember Goldsmith? Remember Coach Goldsmith, right? Yeah. Man. Coach <laughs> 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 Goldsmith? I, I've heard of him, but I'm, I'm the, old, right, well, I'm the shoot, older coming one. Coming out of man. junior high, I was the ball boy for the West throughout the 80s and 90s as a, as a legit. Mm-hmm. So, boom, it's time to graduate high school. I mean, not graduate high school. It's time to go to high school. Well, Goldsmith and Coach Hardwick come to the house, mm-hmm. talk to Grandma. All right, now we done had him. We done took care of him. And last time, you know, freshman year, we gonna make sure you're all right. Mm-hmm. Let me come on over here with us. And Grandma was like, no, nah, I need to be able to keep an eye on my baby. So that's how I ended up on the beach. Mm-hmm. Went to beach high. I was a knucklehead out there. Graduated late. I ain't had the grades to even go to fam. That's how bad I was. Damn. I, I was, I was, Damn. man, I was bad as, as a shorty, I, man. I can relate. I was, <laughs> bad. I, I, I was bad. I was bad as a shorty. So my whole route, my whole route was was a long route, man. It, long story short, I ended up at Oregon State. They gave me a one for one. Mm. Man, I got drafted in the second round. I ain't looked back since. That real now? Uh, I ain't looked back since. I, I, I love your story and um, Tony O'Brien's story because I got to watch y'all. And, and y'all really from Miami yeah. and it's hard like if you from Miami in certain places it's hard to get out I don't know if it's we don't put the extra I don't know what it is but to see people get out yeah. like what can you give <clears throat> I know you know some talented motherfuckers who ain't make it out like there's only two ways there's only two ways to go you know you gotta think Tony Oak could probably attest to this too if he was here mm-hmm. when I was playing well, I'm thinking about everybody in high school all them boys were better than me mm. I was a late bloomer then you got there's two ways from where we from. It's either the streets mm-hmm. or it's sports. Mm-hmm. We ain't got no academic scholars now. Let's just be, just be honest. Right, right. They low so, key. They low key. Yeah, I mean, yeah, okay. Small you, you percentage. Right, right Small I'm percentage. running into them now and I'm proud. I wish they talked more, but. Yeah. But back then, you know, we had a little bit more structure and discipline, especially when it came to the streets. Yeah. So nowadays, you see dudes pulling the, the athletes in. Mm-hmm. And they run the streets and doing stuff. They ain't got no things. Ain't got no business. Mm-hmm. So you got to think. I come from the era, you know, John Doe and all them boy was out back then. And I want to hang around. Yeah, I want to be around. And when shit ain't right, I can't come around. Never. When I want to hang out and and they know business is bad and what's going on out there in the streets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't come around. Never. They kept me. It's it's so funny. The streets kept me. Focus on what I'm supposed to be doing as opposed to pulling me in mm-hmm. and letting me ride along or hang out on the corner. Yeah. Or even <clears throat> think about going that way. Nah. Mm-mm. Most neighborhoods, the streets will take you in and they'll just keep you at the bottom of that barrel, boy. Nah, they they, 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 they push you out of it. Man, the boys ain't play that back then. Yeah. Man. That no infrastructure. Sir. That infrastructure. I, I say infrastructure a lot. It, it feel different now. Like the OGs really like. Watch out for him. All right, I know he a knucklehead, yeah, so let me yeah, just yeah. go ahead and bring him on. But mm-hmm. him, like, nah, he got something that he got going on. Like, leave him alone, keep him out the way. Y'all that boy play ball, boy. Y'all still think it's the same way right now, or it just it's work? Got, nah, <clears throat> ain't ain't no structure now. The ain't young no discipline. Young is young dudes. That's your OG now because they got paper. Like, yeah, that's mm-hmm. true. That's true. Them boys pulling up in a Rolls Royce and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. They think in high school. In high school, <laughs> crazy. Prom's going crazy. Mm-hmm. Prom's Kids going crazy. pulling up helicopters, double R's. Yeah, yeah. yeah. crazy work. Man. We got to do redo our prom. We got to show these young whippersnappers. They got it. <laughs> Cheer. They got it. <laughs> yeah. I, I ain't gonna lie Goddamn with prom, boy. Yeah. Them boys prom, all that you shit. Went, you went to prom, right? For me, you was we wasn't able to make it to prom. No, Ocho. Yeah, I went to prom. I went okay, to prom. Okay. I wasn't. I wasn't in nothing like that. You no know, simple, nice little tux. Okay. Okay. You know. Shit, I was still a virgin back then, man. And Brian, not your <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah. It probably was harder though. Yeah, it probably was, was harder to get sex back then though. What? Bro. No. What? No. Yeah, it's easier no. Now, hey. no. Yeah, I, I think was, it's easier now. I was a late bloomer. I ain't gonna lie. You probably was vibing though because. As I'm hearing the stories back then, it wasn't no waxes, so shit. Yeah, I miss yeah. out on that too. He said it wasn't no waxes. I was, I, a late bloomer. <laughs> oh, like wolf. I was locked in though. I was locked in. You were locked in good. Locked, locked in. I'm just saying, my, my focus as far as football. Oh, yeah, okay. That's okay. all I care about. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All I care about. And then what I saw, obviously, I wanted to be a part of that. Mm-hmm. You know, them boys kept, kept a nigga at bay. Yeah. So I couldn't even float that way. So all I had was football and game, video games. That's it. Mm-hmm. And that's all. That's still me today. Same shit. Football and video games. 
Yeah, so y'all get off my back, man, when I'm on 2K, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but yeah. see, you do 2K, and then you go and try to be that same player on 2K <laughs> at Northern Park. <laughs> like, yeah, look, see, it's like you got to have structure. I ain't going to lie. Funny, that do be real. Basketball helped me learn, like, life, like, trends. Mm -hmm. Like how to lock, I, I make a shooter three good, but a moving three is something else I got to practice. So it helped me understand experience. Yeah. Like I could be good at talking to hoes, but I might be bad at being in a relationship. Mm. Then you get the experience, then I'm yeah, good. Yeah, but how old you is? You ain't mastered that fade away yet. You need to just <laughs> no. I'm like that now. That's your, that's your, that's your, that's your, that's your partner now. That's your, that's your boy. Oh, you begin wet on. Nah, hold on. Nah, I don't do that. But like I just. I don't really play basketball like that. Oh, oh now you don't play basketball like that. Yeah, but he, he better, say, like better that. respond like I that. I know what work do. I know what experience do. Yeah. Like, I live with a woman multiple times. I'm good at that now. Yeah. Nah, but that's what anything, though. Know? They're like practice mm -hmm. made perfect. So, mm -hmm. like, that's what crazy. the game give me, though. It showed me, like, trial and error. Yeah. Mm -hmm. what, what was that time <laughs> period that you was really realized, like, okay, maybe I do got a shot at, like, you feel me, really doing this football shit serious and taking it to the league. Was Pro it early? High, high school. High school? My senior year. Yeah. My senior year, I knew I had a shot. But still, I remember grandma always used to tell me all the time, boy, you need to focus on your books first. Yeah. Because yeah. you're going to yeah. always fall by the wayside if you ain't got an education to back you. Mm -hmm. and you know me, knucklehead. Nah, mama, I got it. Football first. And every time. Fall by the wayside. Yeah. And I barely squeezed through the crack. You got to think, I graduated late from Beach High. Mm -hmm. Then I went to NAIA, NAIA school in Oklahoma, Lynx University. Mm -hmm. So I'm out there, boom, okay, I'm set. Red shirt freshman. Boom. I'm out there fighting. <laughs> man, I never forget Dr. Ernest Holloway, rest in peace, man, they kicked me out. <laughs> I came back to grandma. Say, mommy, it ain't work out like you said. She's like, baby, I wash my hands. I never forget. Like I done all I can mm -hmm. with you all these years. You got to go stay with your mama. Mm. My mama was in LA at the time. Mm. Boom. I ended up at Santa Monica Junior College. Me and Steve Smith Sr. Mm. That's ended up with him out there. Oh, so great. boom, that's two years down. Hold on, I'm wait, like, wait. So you never made it to FAMU? Yeah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell you been at? He waiting on you get the fan. You still waiting. <laughs> I, I, I wish, man. It's, I'm talking about a dream of mine to be at an HBCU. Right. So I go to I go to Santa Monica. Hmm. That's two years down. Mm -hmm. Following year, ineligible again. Damn. So I'd use that whole third year, man. You know, JUCO, two year institution. You're supposed mm -hmm. to be two and out. Yeah. So it take me two just to get my grades right. Yeah, so that's yeah, the third yeah. year gone. Mm -hmm. And get my grades right, play one more year at Santa Monica College. So that's four. I got one year left. Oregon yeah, State. Remember Dennis Erickson from the Hurricanes back in the 90s? He remembered me from the little camps I used to go to. He gave me a shot, gave me a one for one. Man, I went, at the, went to Oregon State, man. I cut a fucking fool. One, <laughs> one year, four months. I was in all and out. Needed. That's all I needed. Just to be, just to display my talent on that big stage. Yeah, Oregon State do be decent every other year, like on and off type. Yeah, so so. Yeah, so so. But that year we was good, man. We won Fiesta Bowl, beat Notre Dame like forty one nine. Yeah, got, drafted, yeah. got drafted that second round. Once I hit that league, it was a wrap. You scored that game? Yeah, I scored twice. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> I was cutting up, bro. So you known for your footwork? Yeah. Was that your superpower back then? Yeah. I always that been a footwork. Niche. Yeah, that's my niche. That's for, crazy. For, that I got paid for my feet, not playing receiver. Mm. I, I, tell, I tell people that all the time. No, I, Back I, then, it was a lot of people like receivers that had footwork, or you were just like selected for real. Nah, because there still ain't nobody with footwork like this today. For today, mm -hmm. nah. Shit, it's a lot of good receivers from Miami though. Name, a name lot. Your top five receivers. Ooh, that's, from Miami. That, that's hard. Ooh, you how you going? That's crazy. Yeah, one going, of my questions I'm is, going, I'm going AB off oh, rip first. That boy man. going crazy no too. No specific order. No, I, 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 don't, I don't do that order yeah, shit. Okay, tough. no specific AB, order. AB, Dre Johnson, mm -hmm. Tanner Man, Beast by Dre, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Antonio, Antonio. Antonio, Antonio, shit, both on Brian both and goddamn Brown. Mm-hmm. Um, damn, who else from the crib? Ain't Quan, Quan ain't from down here. Ain't Quan from up, hey, up in Florida. Who Bolden? Yeah, I think he from West Palm, I think or something. Like shit, that's that's Florida, goddamn it, fuck Florida, it. Florida water. <laughs> who, 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 else, who else we got? Yeah, I think Bo, Roscoe Paris, Moss, Sco, uh, Tanner Man. I mean, I know I'm missing some people. It's, my memory ain't really good right I'm, now. CTE. I'm, I'll be <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got the calm side. <laughs> I got the calm side. I'm trying to think, man. Shit. That's it's, something. There's so, so many gangsters came out of here. Yeah. My favorite, 
you know, my favorite as far as high school, who I always wanted to be like, was goddamn Snoop Menace. Remember Marvin Menace from the West? No? Nope. I, I remember Snoop Y'all boys young, yeah, man. Nah, I, I remember Snoop. Hey, say they names, though. I'm hey. probably, I'm yeah, sure I, they on YouTube. Y'all you know, look that name, it up. That nah. name right there wrong bells. I, look, I looked up to them boys, man, coming up 2-2. Two, two, Tutu at well, Tutu old oh boy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Was at the high back then? Mm -hmm. Man, shh. Old oh boy like that too. What? What do you play receiver? Play receiver. Man, I looked up to all them boys. Cedric Cherry, I think Cedric Cherry said was at Gables. Markeith Hooper was at Palmetto. Magic Benton was at the West. Mm -hmm. And as a legit man, just watching these boys, man, I wish. Like, I'm, I, I modeled and wanted to be just as good as them. I think that's one of the reasons why I made it. Yeah, Iron Shop. I, mean, I always want to be like them boys. Iron Shop. Matter of fact, oh, it's another one, dog. God damn. Nigga went to goddamn fam you and cut a fool. I want to follow in his footsteps. He went to Edison, Jaquay Nunley. I probably remember don't know who his name. Is, but man. Different. Bye, different. I'll probably go. Mm -hmm. This ain't no order, though. No order. Right. I'm really just going by what I seen. Tommy Streeter. Yeah. Hey, yeah. 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 Really yeah. Shout way. out to Streeter. Uh, of course, got to go Ocho, man. Got to go Ocho. Yeah, that nigga was nice. <laughs> <laughs> that, nigga, that, nigga good. that nigga That nigga was all on, on all my creative teams on man, on the Xbox. <laughs> man. I got to go. Who I'm going next? Damn. I ain't think this through. Yeah. I, uh -huh. thought, I, thought, I thought you had I that. Thought ready. I thought he was ready. I thought he was ready. You go to think it, think it, Jerry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now yeah. we got some guys. I'm going. Bro. Got to go, San Antonio Holmes, of course. Antonio mm -hmm. mm -hmm. from the crib. And you went to Carroll City? Yeah. San Antonio Holmes with the Carroll City? I think yes. so. I don't want to oh, be wrong, but I think. Oh, his little brother went to Carroll City. They went to Carroll City. But I ain't know that. They went to Carroll City. Like, why we don't have that? That's too? Like, with the why, City. why we don't be tight knit um, like other cities be, dog? Like, I got to go Eli Rogers. Cause this is what I seen coming up when I when I used to go to the trash and shit like that. Mm -hmm. Trash power for those who watching and don't know what he mean you by the trash. Me? Eli Damn, used to be in the slot. Damn, who else could I go? It's tough. You can go stabbing. Stead. Stead was tough. Stead was tough. That, that my well, hoop, that my hoop partner right, right there. That's one man, my Florida. Yeah, 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 yeah that's the that's the career. My boy won state, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's just what I seen, though. I know a lot of people be like, oh, man, this, 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 this. But I'm just going by what I seen when I used to go to the mm -hmm. games. Yeah. Yeah. We agree with y'all, too, but this is off his purse. Yeah, yeah. 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 You went to what Karen said you looked up, right? Who? Yeah, that boy went to uh, Glaze Central. I was out the road a little bit. That's still the crazy. His little brother went to Karen City, I think. All right. What's good, Stoner Crew? We are back with another P.O. Box opening, you feel me? We haven't did a P.O. Box opening in a while, but we wanted y'all to know that we still have the P.O. Box opening. So any small business out there that still want to promote some stuff on the podcast, y'all send it through to 2413 Main Street, Suite 200, Miramar, Florida, 33025. We are still accepting anything y'all want to promote. Any um, clothing brands, any board games, sunglasses, whatever y'all want to promote. You feel me? And today we do have some packages. Today is sponsored by Mr. Daisy. My boy, Mr. Daisy, came through. Got some t-shirts on deck. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all the t-shirts we got, man. We got flavors too, man. Oh, this fly right here. And my dog got the NFT on the back. Stop playing, man. All kind of different flavors. I'm feeling the pink one. Yeah. Fly shit, you feel me? We got another package. Let's see. We got two hoodies on deck, man. Yeah. Big vibes on deck with the hoodie. Stuff on the sleeve. Got stuff on the back, you feel me? I'm going to put below where you can um, follow Mr. Daisy. My boy, Mr. Daisy. So y'all could... You feel me? Know where y'all could cop at. But like I said, if y'all got anything y'all want to promote, make sure y'all send it to 2413 Main Street, Suite 200, Miramar, Florida, 33025, man. Anything y'all got to promote, especially black-owned business, or y'all come through, tag me in some black-owned business. I will purchase a couple items and stuff like that. And y'all let me know, man. Shout out to Mr. Daisy, man. My boy always coming through. This is like his second P.O. box opening, you feel me? So, yeah. Make sure y'all come through, send the packages through, and we go promote it on the podcast. Now, back to the show.
I want to ask. Um, Let me look. You, you follow high school football right now? A little bit, not too much though. I wanted to ask who you who you who your top receivers coming out this year. Oh shit, I don't even know, bro. I know I was checking out Young Bull from uh Shamanad. Okay. I seen they seven on seven. They got a crazy <laughs> night. Yeah. I can't remember what's what's buddy name with Ohio State. JJ. That's, JJ Smith. That's Smith. Yeah. That boy different. Man, he nice. That boy different. He nice. He nice. He nice. I'm I'm curious to see what he do Ooh, as a freshman. He should as a freshman. He should come in right up right off the rip. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I ain't right gotta up. wait. I ain't yeah, doing yeah. no sit down and behind nobody. Yeah, I, I like I like bro, bro nice. What's the difference in translation from our like let's say I'm elite high school and then I get around college and still elite and then the transition to NFL. everybody elite. Yeah, the speed. Yeah, I, I hear everybody, everybody say that everybody fast. Everybody, everybody fast. So we go from. You know, you being fast and understanding all that ain't gonna do it. The thing that separates you from everybody else is technique and mm. being consistent at what you do. Yeah, technique, technique, technique. and IQ. being consistent at what you do. Mm. Understanding what's gonna happen before it happens. Yeah. Being able to process process that information mm -hmm. when you come out that huddle. Mm -hmm. Being able to process what they doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And at the snap of the ball, be able to read and react mm. and make and, react. and adjust on the fly. Because when you ain't got to think and you know what the fuck you got going on and you know what the fuck they doing, yeah, flow state. You can just be yourself. Flow state. That's where the, the shit talking coming at mm -hmm. and having fun. Mm -hmm. So it don't matter how much you fuck niggas prepare. <laughs> I'm fin it's finna be this. It's yeah, yeah, gonna yeah. be no matter yeah. what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't nothing you can do about that. They prepare for greatness, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. That boy Calvin Russell. I don't know if you heard about that boy. That boy different. Well, yeah. He at the West right now. That boy. Talk uh, about CJ Neve. Yeah, uh, CJ. Uh, that boy number one in basketball, five and star, football. and football. What position? Receiver and, and uh, point, point guard. guard. You like that? Nah, look. Like that. Hey. Like that. Oh. Remember Neve? Different. Baby, you yeah, I remember Neve. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Different. Okay, 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 okay. okay, okay. Different. Hey, I'm yeah. telling you, you go watch that boy game. Like, cause we ca it's kind of biased because we watch him growing up, but he, bro, he like 6'5, but moving like he. 6'5. Five yeah. ten. Yeah. Yeah, he talking different. I don't think it's biased though. Before I said anything, I used to watch him against other elites. I, and he make them look smart. Yeah. Like, okay, it ain't biased now. Mm -hmm. Like it's just the way he moved now. <laughs> that boy moves so fast. It's like, bro, the man moved like he five ten, he six five, blowing pack, head top, uh. Then fuck it. Three months later, dunking. Woo! <laughs> like really carrying the team by himself. Wow. Like that boy yeah. said, he trying to go somewhere right now where they gonna let him play both sports right now. So because his basketball look easier yeah, to me for him, but he want contact. He yeah. he want to play basketball. football. So you got smooth. that chip on the shoulder right now. Basketball That's live. Man, smooth. We got a smooth basketball. Game. It's too easy for him, dog. Bas basketball playing that money though. Basketball yeah. playing that money. <laughs> Brian paid him three hundred some million. But that shit, baseball, hold on, like, you got to think about it though. So if he in high school right now. Mm -hmm. And we got receivers getting 150. Mm -hmm. Chase probably going to get back 150, 180. Yeah, by the boy, time right. he get to the league and hit that second deal, they'll be right back at yeah. about 300. Yep. Yeah. If you think about it. Can they keep going numbers. up. Because yeah. the market going to keep it. Gonna, that's never coming down. So, yeah. so with the NBA, I think they just signed a new media deal. And that market just went way, way up. Yeah. 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 They so said they all that's going on. 500 and shit. So I'm like. Crazy numbers. We say we say athletes or streets, but I think it's entertainment or streets. Now that's real too. Yeah, it's entertainment because yeah. like, you get behind a camera and you a day you might say something funny and now you psh, out of here. Yeah, yeah. real. Yeah. Speaking of money, it just come to patience with all that shit. Uh, Speaking of money, I can grab that S three. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, nil deals. You feel me? Uh, yeah. Started doing it with the high schoolers now. On high school? Yeah, they started for NIL real? for high school, yeah. Dropping a bag now. Hello? Can can NIL be overall detrimental to high school and college athletes? Damn. When I think about how them college athletes used to struggle when it came to having have yeah. something to eat, man. It, even you, you feel me? Like how 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 different would life would have been for you if you would have been able to get NIL deals when you was in college. But we was getting NIL deals when I was young. Chill out now. Chill out now. Chill out now. Okay. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> but I ain't even, ain't, it wasn't even from no schools. It was yeah. from the streets. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's what I'm saying. Boy, you like... ever, boy, you ever been to a football game at Liberty, Liberty City Optimus in the 90s? Yeah. Teddy, Teddy. Yeah. Boy, the, whole, the, same the, whole, thing. the whole city shut down. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. 
Yeah. Ain't no shootings, ain't no killings, ain't no robbing. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Well, you have a good game. Oh, man, them niggas off the air breaking you off. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's our NIL deal. Yeah, 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 when yeah. I was in high school. Yeah. All them boys at the air. When we when we played the West and I had a good game. Yeah. How do you think I got my first Cuban link? <laughs> <laughs> NIL deal. Yeah. In a different way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I think, you know, when you're so young, you know, we don't really be good with money. Yeah. Especially when it come, you know, when it come to money, we got this whole concept that, well, the more you give me, the easier it be. But mm-hmm. if you ain't got no discipline, no structure when it come to spending, man, you're going to blow through all that anyway. Facts. Mm-hmm. Every time. I don't care how much they give you. Yeah. If you got $100, you can't, you can't manage that 100 Shit, you ain't gonna be able to do number 100,000. Yeah. You, you, no matter how much you got. No matter how much you get and how much they give you, you're gonna blow through it. Mm-hmm. Every time. So I think if there was, you know, some financial discipline and they, people got a better understanding of the value of a dollar, mm-hmm. shit, I wouldn't give a fuck about them NIL deals. Matter of fact, they should make the kids take goddamn courses hey, before they that. get that money. Yeah, yeah I was thinking that'd that. Be, that, that. That'd be the best way to go about it. They were uh, discussing that with Teddy, and I was like, NIL, NIL deals should literature come course. with yep, yeah, financial some literature. structure, yeah, yeah. too. Like, it should come with some type of structure. Yeah, that and make, that, make that, that bread last, sense, bro. That's too much money to be given a minor like that. Like, just or million, teach them about that, what to do with it, bro. You... Even the parents, parents got to take the course too, cause you feel me? Like, yeah. they got to know, like, hey man, this is for us to maintain and keep it. while you ain't got to worry about mm-hmm. nothing. All you got to do is focus on football. You ain't got nothing else to worry about. That'll help money, our people grow too. You feel too. me? That yeah. the money coming in, we finna invest it. We finna buy this, buy that property. Woo, woo, woo. Mm-hmm. Even with or without it, you feel me? We got a set structure. Um, how much focus do you think somebody got to put into? You said so what? You got to be locked in, boy. Anything. You talk about being good and great at it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you got to be locked in. So it's like boy, nothing, nothing. 24 hours. How many hours? Nah, not, not 24 hours. Mm-mm. Boy, that morning, that five, five to five. Five to five? five, five, to five. Twelve hours? Five to five. I wake up at five in the morning. I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about, I'm talking about my 12 years playing. Five mm-hmm. in the morning, I'm at the stadium at six. Mm-hmm. Boom, game plan. What we doing this week? Watching film on who, whatever opponent we got. And all mm-hmm. I focus on who I got this week, the number one corner. I watch his last four games. Mm-hmm. I look at, not the script, I look at the chart and the plays that we gonna have. <laughs> <in>. <laughs> I look at the, the, the chart and the routes I'm gonna be running this week. Mm-hmm. And I break down all the film with the dude upstairs on all the routes that he had to deal with from the following four weeks. That was hard for him or easy for him. That was, man, I break that shit down, man, and study, study to a T. Then that by freak. the time Sunday come, I'm already ready. I'm easy. That's why I'm talking shit yeah. throughout the week through the media. Mm-hmm. I already know what I'm finna because get. Because I already know what you finna get. Yeah. I know what time it is. I did, there's no type of preparation you could do. You can't stop a comeback. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> now, to, the, to the point, I was out there, some of the games I was mic'd up, you could see it. I'm telling the nigga my route before I even run the yeah, route. Yeah, I've seen that. I because seen that a few I times. already know. Ain't, not, ain't yeah, nothing. Ain't getting beat. Man, you finna get the work. So ain't nigga. no corner ever give you a hard time. Revis. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Was, yeah. That, 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 that 2009 year, that's probably the greatest year of any quarterback, cornerback ever. Yeah. All the greats. Everybody got shut down. Everybody. To, it's to the point where if somebody say, boy, Revis locked you down, well, shit, he would lock down Jesus. <laughs> Jesus yeah, down yeah. Yeah. But join the club. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, join, yeah. <laughs> hey, that, but that, that year, man, bro was special. Bro oh. was special, man. T.O. one beating him out of nothing. Nobody. Calvin Johnson got it. Dre got it. Randy Moss got Calvin it. Got it. That's hey, big. Every, Mega Trump. Nobody in 2009, that's nobody big. had over 50 yards, boy. That's big. Nobody Damn, had over 50 yards, that's boy. That's major right there. Yeah, bro. That's, 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 that's Cause he could just love That nigga was Randy special, bro. Versus 09 Reading. Put that thing in there. I don't know. You nobody could, stopping Moss, boy. You, no, you, you see the key real. word you said was prime. Yeah, yeah you put you, you put, slow him now. You put that in the album. You put that in the album. No, I, I be hearing that a lot. Like Reeves really was like, you man, feel me? Man, he was like that. But I'm like, damn, I know some good receivers though that like you feel me. But he lost up. If you if you was to get the list when we done, look at the list of that 2009 of the receipt Steve Smith Senior. Of the receivers that mm-hmm. he clamped down the entirety of the year. Not no one week, not two weeks. Nigga, the whole uh, 15, fucking year. Reeves Island. Back then, Shit, right? real. 15. 16, 16 games. 16. Everybody. All right, so um, you was a bit of a game changer, you feel me, in the league. Like, you was the one 
Or would you say you was the one who really took that celebration to the next level? Yeah, yeah. With all the goddamn the props. Yeah. Yeah. Adding props to it. Uh celebrations. It was always some type of theme to it. Ain't you had somebody to marry you one time? Yeah, I asked the chili to marry me. <laughs> Bro, that hoe ain't even <laughs> she didn't give me a number after the game. <laughs> yeah, she said yeah though. Dang hey, man. Yeah, that, social that, that media would have went yeah, crazy. crazy. Oh, back then? Oh. The funny thing about it is I ain't even have social media back then. I remember. You gotta think how I set set myself up after football. Mm-hmm. There was no social media back then. Yeah. And I'm still going strong 12 years later, and I ain't touched the football in years. Mm-hmm. 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 In years. Just so I like it in a sense where players have social media now. Mm-hmm. You could brand yourself. Yeah, I did a marvelous job at branding myself, trying to set myself up once I'm done. But I think today, people are trying to create a brand before they handle their minutes on the field. Yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know, if you, handle, if, you, follow, yeah. you, you handle, if you handle yourself in between them, them white lines and that green grass, you, it everything come. else will take care of itself. It'll come. Yeah, and then if you sure. got any type of personality, oh, it's it's a wrap. It's up. It's, it's up. a wrap. I mean, you ain't even gotta have personality. You see how Kawhi. Barely say any words. Yeah, but he's not but that's his like, he's not he's not he's he with New Balance. They don't mark hey, the <laughs> hey, hey, what's Young Bull? Young Bull from um He just he just got drafted. From Buffalo? Yeah. Mm. Boy. He's branding his yeah. He, uh, he boy. Yeah. But you gotta look at who who the mentor. Character. Yeah. Fast. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Discipline. Mm-hmm. What what else uh, do y'all send to say? Yeah. He said, I want you tough, fast, discipline, with character. Yeah. Hey, that Dion would have hey, been perfect for that, the internet hey, back in the day, boy. Yeah, yeah Prime would have been perfect, bro. Prime, perfect. Yeah, perfect. Psst, yeah, yeah I ain't gonna perfect. lie. I remember playing Madden, boy. I just, I was just trying to do a bombs and just scold this nigga just to celebrate. That's <laughs> all I wanted to do, boy. Once I got close enough, streak. What else? And they hated, What else you done did? That was real crazy. You know, yeah. like I could only imagine. Let me think about one or another Shit. one. That Hall you of ain't pull out the that, phone and call nobody. Nah, that was Joe Horn. That was Joe Horn. Yeah, that Hall of Fame jacket. Yeah, the Hall of Fame jacket, jacket crazy. with the question mark. Monday night, yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> I ain't want to, I ain't want to play no politics. Mm-hmm. I know how that voting work. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. them people. I ain't gonna say the, I ain't gonna say the c word, but them people <laughs> love to have control over us. Yeah, and knowing when we can let y'all in, and they know how we feel about it. Mm-hmm. Uh, we still got power over this yeah. nigga. You know, we could control when and. And how, I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, ain't finna, I ain't finna play that. I ain't play politics. All about a jacket that I can go buy. Yeah, I don't, <laughs> I, don't, I don't like politics. If I did, I would have been a politician. Yeah. Right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let you know that night when I caught that touchdown, I had just crossed the 10,000 yard mark. Mm-hmm. So in my eyes, I felt I'm Hall of Fame worthy. So what I did, got my own damn I jacket. Created my own damn jacket. <laughs> that real that now. That real now. And that's, I don't that's, care that's, what y'all say. I'm Hall of Fame, man. I got 10,000. That's that's what that that's what that that's what that was all about. And whether they put me in or not, and I don't care because the numbers is what they are. Yeah, yeah facts. They, your peers know though. So you think that was your favorite? Your, your, your they, peers, they, oh yeah, like, they, they know. They That's know. what I go by. You think that was your most controversial celebration? Yeah, they ain't like that. Yeah, yeah they ain't like they that. Ain't like that. Matter of fact, you got to think they ain't like the celebrations at all back right. then. They, they, yeah, they didn't like celebrations at all. Yeah, I take all them fines. All the fines. I took all them fines. Dude, I had about two, two point two point two million in fines. Damn, damn. My socks, you know, I used to wear my orange chin strap. I'm, mm-hmm. man, I'm out there, I'm flashy. Yeah, yeah. Orange chin strap, black chin strap. You ain't put the tape on the face fr- Nah, I ain't do that. Ain't Sean Terry used to do that, though. Shane Sean from the crib. On the lumberjack. But yeah. the funny thing about them, you know, this is the whip. Mm-hmm. And I hate to say it like this, but them folks that sit high and look low, it's one way to keep these niggas in line. Mm-hmm. It'll take what they think we value most. Mm-hmm. That's the money. The money. Mm-hmm. So they think, well, you know, how we keep them in line? Shit, just find them. Find them. For everything we don't like. But I ain't kidding nothing about that money because mm-hmm. I'm going to make that anyway. Yeah, I got to pay me. On, on the field, off the field. So I just kept on celebrating and they just kept on taking my money. It got to the point when I got to about year four, year five, I started sending my money into the league office early <laughs> to save them from having to send me like, a FedEx. Yeah, I mean, man. Don't send me no FedEx because I'm telling you I'm going to celebrate and I already sent 10000 and they're going to be there Monday morning. Yeah. <laughs> I got to that scope. point. Finna go, finna do my river dance. That shit used to be no. good. <laughs> so I used to, I used to pay attention to most of um, like people I know from Miami, like the Richard Gore and the DVDs. You like, I, I pay attention. Like, I realize sometimes it don't be the talent. Like one of my 
most excited. I was excited about you at Miami, and we ain't got to go get Ugh. into it. But I was watching I the fought hard. That, knocks. I fucked that off hard, bro. Hey, mm-hmm. it, it, we ain't got it. But I'm saying, like, I'm just watching your route running. Like, <laughs> went to one of the practice. I'm like, oh, we gonna be crazy this year. That's what's <laughs> gonna be celebrate. Everybody is gonna be there. Like, I seen them have leniency for other people for something, and then like, oh, ain't because no, it, ain't no leniency for that boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna like. Certain you got you got a villain mm-hmm. that never listened and did it his way, mm-hmm. and there was nothing they could do because I was great at what I did. Yeah, and to make a mistake of that magnitude, for sure, for sure. Finally, we got this nigga. I was mad at them though, boy. I would never see the light of day. Yeah, nah, not on not on that green grass. Yeah, anytime they would have got to get you, they was gonna get oh, you. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And they just had nothing. There was nothing they could do. Yeah. Cause I didn't do nothing, especially away from the game of football. Yeah. I'm gaming 24 seven. <laughs> I don't go nowhere. I don't club. I don't drink no alcohol. I ain't you, you ain't gonna catch me speeding driving. Outside waiting on you to mess huh? up, just waiting. Yeah, so I, I fucked that up. Yeah, I can respect that. But what? Just football on the own? Yeah. Well, you going crazy that year? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I, I um I remember you were saying on another interview like. You saying how you used to save your money by just like, you feel me, not really spending in the league. Like I, I ain't no point. Huh? Ain't no point. All why them, why you say that? Jury, all them watches and yeah, shit. Yeah. Nigga get caught in that image, yeah. having to look a certain way. You know, oh, I done made it. So if now that I done made it, now subconsciously, I owe and got to be on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, what time it is real quick? What time it is? Look on your phone. 10.03. 10.03. You just gave me the time. Mm-hmm. How much that cost me? Free. <laughs> that shit was free, right? Yeah. So what the fuck I'm paying eighty hundred thousand dollars for a watch for? For the look. Investment. Hey, that's nah, a fucking, that's ain't no investment. fucking man. Ain't fucking no that's fucking investment. That's what somebody's gonna tell you. Oh, yeah, that's what they say. Eight thousand dollar watch and it's gonna go up. Man, and exactly. The funny you know thing saying? is though, when you pay, stop, stop, they say like, okay, say somebody <laughs> pay like seven thousand dollars for a Rolex, right? You give it like probably a year, two, two, three years, it go up to like 30, 40, right? No bust down though. Look, no bust down, right? Okay, it's an investment. But over that time you done spent with that watch, you grown an attachment, a love to this watch. So some people ain't looking at that as no investment. They be man, like, man, they, this my baby, you heard if they, was, if they was really thinking like, thinking like that, mm-hmm. if it really was about investments and buying stuff, then why 90% of us still go broke when we done playing after two years? Mm-hmm. Why Where that money went? The They're numbers, the numbers still ain't changed. Yeah. What the numbers of the number has not changed. The percentage hasn't changed in athletes, NBA, NFL. Going broke after the league? Two years. Damn. Two years now. Because it's long impossible term. to keep up. That's it's, no impo- time. it's impossible to keep up that lifestyle once some checks stop rolling in. Well, you ever seen a check every Monday, nigga, for 300000 Mm. Yeah. Nah, I wish. I'm, I'm just saying. Just, just, <laughs> I'm just, I'm just, just giving you perspective. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 300,000 every week for six months straight. You do the math. We see that on a lower scale too when people have like certain little spurts of money from yeah, whatever yeah. they're doing and then nine months. It, they, blow, they, blow through, they blow through it, right? Yeah. I always tell people it's a nine months to me. I see it go no matter if it's a meal or 20 bands. I give you nine months. If the discipline ain't there, it don't for matter sure, how much they give you. For now sure. I gotta get money and eat McDonald's, man. <laughs> it is right like trying to tell these. All these and any t- you wanna holler at chicks if she don't want to go to McDonald's? Nah, she a liability. The mm-hmm. real don't even do it. I'll Root Chris, bo- I take you Bole, baby. Just, just meet me at. You said Bole? Yeah. I be mad it? watching this nigga eat McDonald's, bro. I can't get no six pack for nothing, bro. I be eating cauliflower rice, <laughs> avocado. Like boy, I still can't get that. Now, that I boy eat. eat you McDonald's. know what I always say though? When you make it. It's okay to enjoy the fruits of your labor. Yeah. Enjoy the hard work. You put the work in it. It's okay to enjoy yourself. Mm-hmm. But everybody get lost in it. It yeah, becomes yeah, an yeah. image. It becomes your identity. It becomes a character. Mm-hmm. And that's still to this day. I, I, I'll just I, I ask preach that. Are, are you still the same all, way? I preach it all the time. Hell yeah. So, no, so I, I, I <laughs> dibble and dabble because I'm making more now than I was when I was playing. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. I'm making more now. Probably because your overhead now. Is it? Is it that why? Nah, I'm over, I ain't had no overhead. What overhead? Yeah, I ain't had no overhead. Hell nah. Mm-mm. Just all the all the shit I got going on. Yeah. ESPN inside the NFL. Mm-hmm. I'm with EA. You got Shannon. With I got YouTube. me and uh, me and Unc. Oh yeah, my god, sir. me and Unc eating. <laughs> He's a man, how, how, was that, how was that though? Like transitioning to just being on that podcast because I could be myself. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. for sure. I could be myself, and we talk about everything, anything mm-hmm. from sports. Anything. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of from that. sports. Thanks. To Shit, you talk about anything here too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, 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 yeah. I just don't want to. No, no. Wanna go too crazy. But don't, don't worry, we got some questions. We go get. Yeah, it. Me, and, me and me and Unc, man, that shit, and it took off so fast, bro. 
Yeah. It took off so fast. Cause both of y'all are people. Yeah, who Shay people Shay. like to see and talk like. And the stories we talk about mm -hmm. is yeah. this stuff we ain't never touched on. You know, Uncle ain't never touched on it cause he's always in a position on linear television. We yeah. didn't act like that. Mm -hmm. So to see Unc wide open and talk about some of the stuff during his day and Oh, dog, it's it's beautiful. Shay Shay used to be selling out on the field too. I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he used to be talking now. Selling out too. Boy. He talking. He remind me of my Alabama. He, side I of think family. he called the phone to my call home. Call, 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 <laughs> call, 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 call the national guard. Yeah, call the national guard. <laughs> he needs some help. He needs some help. <laughs> But that's hey, that boy is strong though. <laughs> yeah, that boy, yeah. Big than a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, I man. wouldn't even play well, I don't be like he want my girl and shit. I'm gonna be looking at her. Why you ain't gone yet? <laughs> Go on, get now. Go get now. <laughs> hey, that'd be funny though, hearing y'all opinion, cause you can't really hear opinions from people like who ain't proved themselves. You feel me? Right. So hearing it from y'all two who really went out there and like did it. Really mm -hmm. did it at an yeah. extremely high level and really dedicated themselves. Like y'all able to talk y'all shit for real. Yeah, for real. and give yeah. us a closer look. Like yeah, yo, this shit really going down. You feel me? Mm -hmm. That's that's cool. Unk, Unk be a little tough on people, man. Especially the athletes. Yeah, he don't cut people no slack. Cause I'm these, a little bit more lenient. Yeah, I'm, I ain't that far from playing, so I got a, a better understanding. Mm -hmm. But damn, I know what buddy going through. Mm -hmm. Shit, I remember what it felt like to drop an important pass on third down. Mm -hmm. You know, so. Mm -hmm. I kind of kind of side with the with the players in a in a in a sense, and Unc all the way on the other side. He TV mindset. <laughs> this white oh come on man come on Unc. don't don't do that don't do that. But we he, met we he mesh grew well up in together. Georgia. He ain't grew up with you know what I'm saying like it, his background. I could see why he like so strict too. Yeah. Man. In that old school mentality, same way though they they used to keep us structured when we younger. Yeah. yeah. Like as we grew up, hey, I got some old heads. When we go pull up play at the park, them boys. Grabbing fish, they telling us how to vibe. They mm -hmm. bringing our food. We not doing that yet, mm -hmm. and I don't know. I don't know where that transition went. Where we like more lenient, we more understanding. But like I like, I wish we had a good balance of that structure mm -hmm. and that leniency or the understanding, empathy we have as younger people. We fried, man. That's all I can say. Internet got us fried, but yeah. I be picking up my phone. I ain't got nothing to do. I just look. I right, ain't nothing going on, and just put it back down. But I really don't be knowing. Instagram. Social media is cool, mm -hmm. but Instagram and what your the character and what you're able to display that ain't really reality. Yeah, fucking with a lot of people's heads. Yeah, mm -hmm. that ain't real life. Yep. Yeah, that's real. That ain't that ain't real life. Oh, you out on you a yacht could, every day. Every time I see you on a yacht, man. You could be you could be who you want to be. Yeah, I don't want nobody you could on be who yacht. you want to be. That's yeah. all it is. Twenty four seven, you acting. That real now. Twenty four seven. I got one more uh, sports question. Who, what's your first three picks in fantasy football this year? Mm. Damn, I don't even play fantasy. Ah. Well, shoot, number one. I was trying to get an inside. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> that boy looking hey, over there. Hey, he in my league. Like, hey, yeah, hey, what, what you picking? You, hey, you bogus. should get a group and y'all should. That's good. Man, these content, niggas be having me up at three I'm in the morning. Listen, we are we are every year. It's three the in the morning. Are, yeah. That's what that's when free agent up. Oh Shoot. Yeah. Your yeah. number one pick always a quarterback, right? Not always. No, they don't Shit. even they pick they receiver. McCaffrey, yeah, Christian McCaffrey, yeah. Christian McCaffrey yeah. been the, the number first? one pick. Yeah, yeah. Listen, what? man, well, if, you got a Ty, if you got Tyreek, CMC, yeah. mm -hmm. Hefe, or like, or like Lamar Jackson, 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 you get Lamar Jackson or some crazy shit. Hefe? Nah, the best the pick Vikings? is Tyreek Hill, man, yeah. what you doing that yeah, shit. Yeah, Ty, Tyreek Hill wasn't the- I remember the, one year I had Tyreek Hill and they got like 60 in one week. Yeah, yeah. No, listen, that boy, he won it by himself for me. Tyreek is awesome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but Hefe, and it's crazy because when he picked him, I'm like, bro, what you doing, bro? He, bro, that boy showed me. That boy went crazy. I'm telling y'all, you got to pick them people that make. Basically, fantasy is like people that can make plays happen, bro. Yeah, big plays like, or get the ball a lot. The more it's easy when you think about fantasy, and I don't, I don't play it. Mm -hmm. But you look at the rosters, right, and look at the players, especially offensively. Yeah, and look at those who are gonna get the most opportunity. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Whoever get the whoever getting the most opportunities, obviously, I'm assuming that's they get to the that's most points. Yeah, yep. But that's, that's all. Is you don't go by name or favorite or what he did for you last year. Opportunities and who's consistent. Because mm -hmm. if if five of them getting high, they getting high opportunities. That's the hard part, right there. The consistency, yeah. consistent. But that's what I'm saying. That's why Tariq, like. Bro, that man too fast. You got one over top, you got one spine in the middle, and you got a corner directly over, and you still can't do like, it. Like, man, two well, close still throw If it up. people were smart last year, they would have took Brandon Ayuk over Debo Samuel. I, it, I, I traded for him. Because Brock Purdy, number one, 
Target last year yeah. was burning on you. But yeah. they were so deep at the 49ers. Yeah, that's yeah, the thing. But CMC going to get you all. He, he always scored a touchdown every sure. game down there last year. Almost. CMC yeah. Who CMC was he going to get? 12 catches, bro. The sleeper for me was um who, bro, had from the Panthers? From um, the Panthers? The Panthers? Yeah. That running back with the H? Hub? Hub? No, Lions. Laporta. Oh, and oh, Laporta. Uh, Laporta. Uh, Laporta. Saint Brown. And um, Amon, Amon, Amon Saint Saint, them two right there, they it was eight. nasty. Jeffrey yeah. Henderson from the Vikings before he got hurt. Mm -hmm. Crazy numbers. I, and I let him do it. I'm like, bro, Jared Goff having like 60 passes a game. I'm like, God damn, bro, slow down. <laughs> yeah, bro. A lot of people think Jared Goff, Jared Goff trash. He not trash. Yeah, nah. that, nah, he not trash. He not trash. He, he, not know, trash. he on the right team, he right, right system. It'd be about the right system for real. Right, right uh, supporting cast around mm -hmm. him. He that was a good straight. trade, that Metro staff for the Jericho. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was even, Metro super even. Gangsta too. Hey, I, even. I love to see, like, you pick a nice group of people who going to actually be involved yeah. and do fantasy. Yeah. Like, hey, I'm telling hey, you. Hey, nah, don't do it, bro. I don't like, we, <laughs> we be in that bit fighting. <laughs> 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 no, we be real? in that bit fighting for every real? week, bro. Just because they can't get a trade off. Oh, like, nigga, damn, boy, you hating on my trade. Nah, you going to get on the trade. grab what you can get. Yeah. Ain't nobody doing that. All right, y'all got any more questions before we go ahead and get into these topics? No. Um, I got one. All right, what's I, up? This is my, this Miami base. We do this for Miami. Like, you really from down here. Mm -hmm. I know you get to talk to the kids, the youth all the time, but <laughs> what can you give them? Like, hey, bro, I know you talented, or I know it's politics. Like, what can you give them to make them see, like, the finish line and don't worry about the obstacles? You got to stay locked in. You ain't got no choice. Like and I can't outside. want it for you. You got to want it better than I want it for you. Mm -hmm. And half the time, they don't even see it that way, though. Yeah. They being pulled from so many different directions. Obviously, social media has become a problem. Yeah. Even as jits. Okay, I'm trying to brand myself and get my name out there. Man, it, on the field, will take care of anything you need. What mm -hmm. you do out there in between them lines. Nothing else matters. Nothing else matter. Because if you trying to brand yourself and get your name out there and mm -hmm. your play don't match up with your brand, then it's a conflict of fucking interest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, facts. It don't make no sense. Facts. Mm -hmm. It don't make no sense. I ain't gonna lie. I got, I got a good question, right? See how they got the NIL deals right now. Let's say you was getting like a guaranteed like two, three million, right? Because some of them are. You mm -hmm. feel me? Would you stay four years in college and Stack that money up, or would you take that leap of faith and just declare it? And it depends on how it depends on how good you are. Mm -hmm. Because if you're getting two, three million in college, man, you got to be that boy. Yeah, you have to be that boy. Yeah, and sometimes depending on how advanced you are at your position and how mm -hmm. good you are, mm -hmm. you can make you can make that jump. But that jump to that NFL, boy, it's a different, grown men, man. Different beast. <laughs> and grown men, you can talk about grown men that got mouths to feed. Yeah, they mm -hmm. got families to feed. They got bills to pay. Mm -hmm. And if you think you come from college all willy nilly and just gonna take in a good job, it ain't it ain't that sweet. It ain't that it ain't happening like that. Hmm. Unless hmm. you really, really that boy. And you gotta be like you that. You got to have that dog in you. You gotta be you like gotta that. Have that dog in you. Yeah. When everybody on the field fast from the from the D line to the to the O line, everybody running four five, four sixes. That shit a different kind of beast, boy. It ain't just by speed, it ain't just by strength. More by IQ technique, how you were just saying, you feel me? Yeah, though. All right, man, let's get into these topics, right? First question I got for y'all. Should people in a relationship be clubbing? Yeah. Not yeah. together. Why not? Hell no, man. Why you can't have fun with well, your wait, spouse? Wait, you ask it together man, or just in hell general? Hell no, you go to clubs. Just in girl. general. Sometimes, yeah. yeah. Not all the time, bro. No, like, I'm yeah, saying like, it, I ain't doing that. What, what's the real Sometimes, reason? Yeah, bro. What's the nah, real reason bro, if you're in a relationship? Why are you going to the club? What, yeah. what, what is your? So what you is feel the like how I feel about the club? I go to the club if we, if it's for business or you fishing. <laughs> yeah, but if, it's, if we going with the boys, I'm going. I ain't going to fish if I'm in a relationship. I can't be out there. But that's what I'm saying. Much. You going with the boys, what you doing? Like, what we you doing? It's a social thing. If you I can't go by with your boys because you in a relationship? If I go by myself, you got to oh, worry. Man, I'm at the booby that. trap by myself. You got to worry. Like, that's kind of buzz, you, you get in a relationship, now you can't hang with the fellas? That's buzz, bro. So, 
So you will go to the club with your girl? Sometimes, that was the yes. question yes. was. I would all that go, other shit I would you go talking about? Yes. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Yes. So what club would you go with your girl? Whatever, bro. Strip yeah. club, whatever club, whatever dance club, whatever it is, bro. It depends on how she. I'm not vibes. saying that's all I'm going. I would like, yes, I would go out with my girl. Yes. Listen, if it's for business, if you networking, okay, cool, that's a different story. But for you to just like wake up and go to the club, yeah, I think that's like. I mean, you going out the happy hour just randomly? Yeah, all right. What are you just popping in the happy hour for? Like, what are you doing that? And yeah. I'm going to get fooled. We from the crib. You know, too. happy hour different. Yeah, I'm especially talking about in club Miami. when yeah, I, yeah. I'm getting dressed at 12, 1 to pull up at 3 by myself. Mm -hmm. Is that's, that respectable? No, that's, I mean, nah, I, I don't you know. You know why I want to go to the club with my girl? Because when girls get drunk, I don't want to be responsible for all that, bro. Oh, when they like overly <laughs> drunk, they throwing up, yeah, can't handle they self. But that's, that's when they get overly yeah, drunk. Like, hold like, up, I'm no. here with my man. He finna drive me home. I got a designated driver. I know I'm finna make it home. No, and I got action when I get to the crib. That real, nah. That real. Look, I no if they go out, go with your girls. Come to me. Let me get that after effect. <laughs> yeah. All that. I don't want to go through the process. That's, that's uh, the after effect. The throwing up. You got to clean nah, up. Nah, that. but I've been and got some by then. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about getting out the car, bro. You know, I had girls fall asleep in the car on the way to the crib. Oh yeah. The, come on, I ain't got time for that. that oh, I think yeah. That's why it depends on who it is. Because I know some troopers who don't really get that messed up while yeah. they. Yeah, like yeah. they know, like I ain't getting that turn. Yeah, it depends, bro. Then it's like you bring your problem. girl to the club. What you say, Ocho? What you say? I don't know. I don't club, bro. Nothing. Nah, I ain't on club. No, hey, on my side, too much yeah, stuff. I, I, I that can happen. You just said booby trap, and I ain't. I ain't been here all my life. I ain't even been to booby trap. Stay out, yet. them people lame, man. Don't yeah. Yeah. Hey, man. <laughs> they they waiting we on at? you too. I, ain't been, I keep here. I love hearing the story though. Nah. Yeah, I ain't been to club live yet, but I like to hear the stories. Yeah, yeah. You ain't going, never do live. Not drink, even as a man, team. You see the prices in live, nigga. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I ain't paying that shit. Never. What? See, man. Never. See, man. It's it's refreshing. Y'all hear him now. Let me tell you. Yeah, nah. Him, no? uh -uh. But I like the story. The stories be the stories be dope. <laughs> stories be raw as fuck. Yeah, on my side, man. We ain't going to the club. Go yeah. to the club with your girl, cold nigga. Try to holler at your girl. He done grab with your girl, say no. He done cussed out. Now she coming to you. Babe, that nigga just called me a bullheaded. Now you, you got the Tito breath. You ready to fight? That's the only thing that I've been doing. That, 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 that rarely happens, though. I can't rarely that happens, happen, boy. If you got that one rarely of, happens, when you got bro. one of them ones, bro. I done been in clubs, bro. At, like, you don't go to the club a lot. Like, you ain't even putting yourself in that predicament. For me, I used to go to the club. With your girl? All the time. My girl. My girl, my girl, my girl. My girl. <laughs> but yeah, bro, you just go to the club. Bro, that red, like his situation, I rarely seen that happen. It happens. I ain't saying I it don't happen. happen before. But I rarely see like, it take happen. Take one. If I'm, if I'm with my girl and I know like, <laughs> nah, like she one of the ones, uh -huh. I would rather it be us going. I don't mind going by myself, but I just know I got to be on different type of time. Yeah, I ain't really my girl drinking like that. I ain't really smoking going like that. To the club. Somewhere where everybody don't go. We ain't going to no office no take one that's that, also like true that. like yeah, we'll probably yeah. go to not even tootsies we'll probably have to go to like fucking just a bar or uh, something Las bro. Olas. Yeah, tussies, tussies. <laughs> like, but i i see like a restaurant yeah like it's me and my girl me and my girl go to tussies now yeah. my girl my girl, to, my girl hey they got their shrimp fried rice now mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. the shrimp fried rice with the, the lobster tail, tail. Stop playing, you got bro. Yeah. Mac and cheese That's too. a restaurant to me. I look at Tussies. That's a really, restaurant. Yeah. Hella see, space, hella spacious, hella be, vibe. See, if you take a girl to Tussies, you got to love her. Nah. Mm -hmm. Yes, you do. Because if you take her there, it's a slight chance that anybody else you like going to be in there. You might not have them no more. I, I take them in there for that reason. You got to see. Well, like see, it, you it, like that type mm -hmm. of energy. I don't like that. I you like gotta everything. See. Hey, you know what's crazy? I used to feel like that, right? But every time I used to take that gamble, I never used to see nobody like mm. ever like Ever, mm -hmm. it might be your lucky day. <laughs> it's never my lucky day when I go in there. Everybody trying to be low key and tussy. That's yeah, why you yeah. don't see nobody. Everybody might. They in people that got their upstairs vibe. They in that cut. Yeah. I used everybody, to be in the nah, back by the pool table. Nah, everybody upstairs. Nah, yeah. hell no. Nah, ain't nobody upstairs from the internet. Nah, you crazy. I was yeah, upstairs I with know. somebody uh, like an unusual suspect. I'm upstairs at by the bar. I'm seeing everybody walk in. They just don't look. Yeah, like, yeah. Everybody minding their business. business. Yeah. I got, you I got, think they minding their business until you get on the internet. <laughs> I got one homeboy always catching tootsies. He know who his short self <laughs> is. <laughs> and he always had to come to the back. Yeah, boy, such and such. Walk down to this. Let him know I'll back here with you. <laughs> Damn, that tootsie lost the tail. It is good. Though, to see for yeah, I know you going after this. <laughs> 
Hey, yeah. all right. Mac since, and cheese. since we stay staying on this topic, right? I was thinking about something earlier today, right? Why is girl math so bad? And what I mean by that is why they don't understand that if they give us something, they might get it back in triple. Like I see everybody, like I see all my homeboys right now on the timeline, like, dang, I gotta buy NCAA by myself. Mm-hmm. Dang, I gotta get mad by myself. It's gonna mm-hmm. be a cold winner. Cause they ain't got no money. <laughs> yeah, they ain't got no money. That's Bruh, good anybody that can't buy a game for you, what's one reason you can't buy something? They just don't want to buy it. They just feel like the pride, like, oh, he got money, he could buy it himself. That's uh, how I pride. feel. They got money. Because yeah, if they want to get up and go on a girl, girl trip, or they want to get up and get some food, and you, look, no, they go, they go find a way to get it. You gotta understand, girls do shit and be broke, bro. That's true. They will go on a girl's trip, broke as hell. Hey, how you say a, a man won't do that? How you say uh, a watch is an investment? You buy this game for me. First off, you gonna have me in the house, and two. I might pay you back in triple. Like, damn, you bought this game for me? I didn't even have to ask you. What you want? I don't, you I don't, hungry? Oh, you ready to... It's a lot of... <laughs> I, I, hey, see, men be so simple. All it takes is one video game. That's, that's it. Y'all easy, bro. That, that's that's what I'm trying to tell you. A Girl game, math is bad. Booty. Hey, but they nah, don't nah, like nah. us. They don't <laughs> like that some of us game. But some women don't want to see nah, us game. They don't, don't understand. Like, I'm, I'm out the way. I'm still doing what I need to do. Girl you math... Nigga get get money, nigga. Girl math is goddamn wanting a nigga that's rich but broke as hell. So if a nigga fall off, how the fuck you gonna support the nigga? That real? That, that, that girl, girl map is bad all around. Girl, girl, girl map is bad all around. Horrible. See, I don't lie though, bro. You ain't had that experience. If a girl can't get you a game, bro, a game, bro. bro I see everybody on my time. Game, even, even the fact if that a nigga got to ask. I'm going to keep it on If you do all that, like, and you buying her and you eating her and you can't get a game, bro. Yeah, You'd be surprised, bro. Just, that, that, just let it go, bro. I'm you know, gonna be that's the same girl. Every five-star restaurant in the I world. I don't think they broke, and though. you can't get a game. I don't think $60. they broke. They have cost 300 500 yeah, you feel sometimes. Me? Like, Man, they up. just don't. It, yeah, pay, but they be getting sponsors, on. bro. Who pay for it? Exactly. What the hell? Yeah. They got sponsorship. It depends. It, it depends. They it depends. not paying for it. Hey, if they don't got a sponsor. I get to see both. I get to see both, bro. I get the... I had the luxury. Man, these girls oh, really don't be having no break. money. Cause if you really, if you really keep it a buck fifty, right? Say the average girl probably make twelve hundred every two weeks, right? How uh-huh. much is they here? Three hundred. Three. Three hundred. Three four hundred for a good. How wig. much it is to get it done? Probably a good one fifty. Two hundred. Two hundred. Right. All that ain't included. How much it is to get their nails done? Good one twenty. One twenty. But depending on uh, feet yeah. in, yeah, about two hundred plus tip, I guess. Feet yeah. in hands. Damn, I'm really knowing this math. This yeah, shit yeah, crazy. Yeah, right. like, that only lead them with $512 for two weeks. And then they got a nigga paying for everything else. <laughs> so what the fuck make you think hey, you finna get an $80 Chase, game? Now check me out. This is what girls math so bad. A $100 game can get you all those things for free. Oh, yeah. If I ain't got to ask you for the game, for the for the game, game. Yeah. See, that soon just as you might ask be, me for the hair, but oh, that yeah, just, baby, hey, look, look, that's the, that just <laughs> might be your love language. Like you just might be a nigga that just like acts of service. Like just do for me, and I'ma just make it, make it, make triple, it happen, make mm-hmm. it triple. I ain't gonna lie, I don't mind. I don't, if you making my life easy, I'm trying to do the same thing. You feel no, me? Yeah. That's not a bad thing though, bro. That's girl, I'm just saying, like I'm just saying, that's girl. The like, funny thing about it, if she's in tune with you and what you like. Mm-hmm. She gonna already know. Mm-hmm. You ain't got to ask for the game. You ain't got to yeah. ask. But if she know, two K goddamn two. She know two K coming out. Yeah. Or NCAA twenty five coming out. It's already gonna be there. Already, already. download already. it. Already. It's, it's, on, it's on your timeline already. all day. I know every nigga. You feel me? Everybody on the yeah NCAA NCAA. You ain't even got to ask. But I tell you what. You know what a real bitch you do. If no, she ain't got it, she gonna ask her other nigga for the money. <laughs> <laughs> that was hey, real I, I knew you were gonna go there. That was real bitch right to do it. She ain't got it. Go get it Man, for that other nigga. Cause you know I'm gonna pull up when I when you need me to pull up. So at least Trim. you can do is go ask the other nigga for the money <laughs> for the game up. for a nigga. This is rent a shit. Yeah, I ain't trip. Lay away. Listen, you could have did anything. It's a hundred dollars. What is that? Hundred dollar investment with a guy. Corona, 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 fifteen dollars a week. Yeah, yeah, ten dollars right now. Ten dollars a week. It's on the way. Great investment, man. If you. If you want somebody to pay for your nails, your hair, give him NCAA, give him mad, give him 2K. He's going to sit at home. Buy that man a game, bro. Buy it. Don't let him ask either. Don't wait till he asks. But if he needs to be looking for a job, he don't need no game. That real now. He don't need me. Mm-hmm. That real now. Because that's what he going to do. That's, yeah, that's a difference, baby, though. That real now. That's a difference. But if he, you feel me, you know he chilling, you know he probably want to hang out. 
that game and having like boy, I almost fell asleep playing that shit last night. Like boy, boy I, I locked seen, in. I seen this couple had posted something on IG, dog. That she just every day cook the same day. That boy sitting on the game, same time. Like that was they family it, yeah. time. Oh, you remember? Oh, I seen that Bit. shit. I was like, that. They was that nice. shit had me rolling though. You know what they, they said? They seen about the nigga how he looked it though. Boy, <laughs> said the nigga. <laughs> they said the nigga looked like the nail polish emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Since we on that though, boom! I got a question. What's up? What's the dumbest thing y'all boys ever spent y'all money on? For myself or for somebody else? Just the dumbest thing you ever spent money on? I got too many. Uh, just dumb, like I ain't gonna lie. Strip club shit. I ain't gonna lie. Strip spent, club for I you? Throwing it right. Shit, strip club. Uh, yeah. Hey, yeah. I, I was finna say a Pacific club, but I ain't finna do no bad. Don't promotion. indict yourself. Yeah. Like that. No, I, I, I ain't finna do no bad promotion. I'm huh? gonna say strip club, bro. Bottles, booze, section, wands. Yeah. That shit is retarded, bro. Shoot. Banshees and banshees and donks from my people in back in the hood. For others. For oh, not others. for you. So I remember I bought seven. Damn. Mm. I bought, bought seven, seven donks. Bought seven at the same time. So Damn. when I move, everybody else can move. Shit. Ain't hey, nobody build up the on these they ain't build up. Not one about that. It wasn't about that back then. I did seven at one time. And it wasn't even football money. It was the money, the TV money I was making in the off season. Mm -hmm. So I ain't, it, it wasn't nothing. That boy said seven of them shit. Banshees, I think I bought about 10 Banshees. So when I ride, shit, we all ride. ride. Damn. Shit. That's a lot. Keep in the hood. I ain't going to lie. That's a lot. I know it looked good. I, I know it felt good when, when yeah. it's going down. That, I know that looked good, though. All right. I like oh, you said, oh, the dumbest thing. All right, Cole. Oh, uh, no. JP, you got one, you got an answer? I don't want to. I don't want to double up with the uh, club. I was just trying to think, but it's it's that though. Like spending money on trips, food, like stuff that ain't trips even just ain't you. Safe. Yeah, but some of that wasn't for me. Some of that is make sure all this could go at the oh, same yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Some of that, like, okay, we some some of us work, some of us handle money, get money other, other ways. When it comes in large sum. We just we we too loose with yeah. bread. We too loose with bread. Ain't no way you could see a hundred bands, five hundred bands, and then a year later you can't point one thing out around you that you spent that money mm. on. What Jesus said, <laughs> looking at my safe, like what the fuck is what, <laughs> yeah, yeah, what, what the, the fuck is the rest goes, at? Yeah. Looking at my watch like it's a bad investment. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, boy, that boy talked that shit on a recession. Yeah, Jesus, you should be. Going. I think a few of us could have had a few cribs. Just, yeah, for sure. Yeah, bro, clubs got a lot. But you can't take that to tussies. You can't walk in the house with a crib. Yeah, I can't walk in tussies. Can't walk in tussies with no car, man. You you got like, that chain on, boy. You, you the man. You tussies gotta on. smell me. You feel me? <laughs> yeah, I'm fried. Uh, dumb thing I ever bought NFTs, man. I spent a couple thousand. <laughs> 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 Okay, I was man, these niggas were so up and down. They had a the future oh in the call, y'all. Oh man, these niggas bought <laughs> NFTs, y'all. Listen, man, this had to be the dumbest shit these hey. niggas ever bought. <laughs> All right, you got me there. I got, I still got my NBA Top Shot too. Hey, you feel me? Hey. Yeah, for I real. remember, like, I yeah, boy, you to say. niggas buying Disney NFTs. Yeah, they yeah. bought yeah. a frog. Safe you move. Swore Shout out to the Safe Move family. Grand, though. Boys gonna go up. A picture. Profile picture, man. Oh, My profile picture look different. Look like a Mario Kart uh, <laughs> type shit. Damn. Yeah, 2020, it, 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 these it, it, niggas it. got these niggas had an illusion. It is what it is, man. Yeah. You, you miss every shot you don't take. Bro. I ain't gonna lie, you stupid as fuck. <laughs> swamp, what it was? Swamp, 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 swamp verse. Yeah, swamp yeah that's verse. the one I really think about, boy. That shit had me in the headlock, boy. So, I remember getting them boy, shit. Boy, I ain't gonna lie, it's still gonna boy, go up. Y'all, y'all just wait. I don't know where that NFT money went. Man. Them people that was selling them pictures hit major. No, yeah. them people made so much money so fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah And yeah, they yeah. probably uh, vanished, like cleaned up the office. Straight pumping dumps. <laughs> yeah. Straight pumping dumps. That yeah. shit was a, uh, what they call the shit? Oh, pyramids. A pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so what else should I know, Mo? Don't know. He don't know. I don't so like you probably it. can't even Google this shit. I got, I got one NLT. No, I got two NLTs that still work. You feel me? It's still doing good. What, and what and they just Mario signed Walmart shit? deals and all kinds. Of, you feel me? It's some. That's still doing what it's supposed to do, but mm -hmm. when it when it when hey. the when the market crashed, mm -hmm. it won. Mm -hmm. You feel me? It won a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it won a lot going on. All right, man. So check me out, right? I got another relationship question. I don't know why I got so many. Oh lord, oh, I can tell we've been sleeping on the couch. My girl, my girl, my girl, my girl, my girl. girl. Sleeping on the couch this week. Check me out, man. When is the right time to move a girl in? 
Oh mm. shit. Uh-uh. Huh? Mm. What? I'm I'm asking that right. Cause when is the when right y'all time get to move a girl in? My experience, right? I moved my girl in because I was grinding on 2K, not checking my phone. You feel me? Like I was going like six, seven hours. Missing you know how that shit be. Yeah, you in the rec center. Yeah. You got 40 missed calls. You're like, oh shit. Like you really just tapped in. I'm like, nah, I can't keep going through this. You know what? Let's just, just move it. Yeah, let's just yeah, just come over here, man. Like, like you just move, you moved in? Yeah. Had to. Yeah. It was too much, bro. Like I bro, I was getting lost on my metaverse headsets. I'd be in that shit for four hours going fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Missing my phone calls. I'm like, man, you know what, man? Just, like, yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, just come over here, man. Now, how long, how long y'all been together? Uh, six years. Okay. You feel me? Like, good move in right there. Yeah, good move in. Like, right first, first and she's solid, though. She's solid. She's I, solid. I just made sure I had my man cave, you feel me? So I can still do it. I'm, hey, you just got to come downstairs and catch me, you feel me? Right. Or get my attention. I'm but, home, baby. But yeah, I'm you feel me? <laughs> you but gotta, it's kind of hard to explain that. Like, yo. I'm missing for six hours. Like, where you been at? I've been playing 2K. That sounds hard to believe. Yeah. You feel me? Like, yeah. bro. I've been in the gym. And you for still four trash. Hours and it's hard. hard to believe. <laughs> <laughs> hey, boy, listen, boy. My me plan. and this nigga, boy, we be in that wreck. Nah, for real. For we real. look up. It's four in the morning. Boy, I had somebody tell me that I was cheating on them because I was in the gym for four hours. Yeah, listen. That's too long to be in the gym. Crazy, bro. You going out, you work out 45 minutes to an hour, and then yeah. you go play basketball. Yeah, yeah. Like, especially basketball. Type of nigga I am. If I was to ever even work out, bro, I probably wouldn't work out for about 30 minutes, bro. <laughs> you don't need to be doing all that what shit. What the bro. fuck? <laughs> what? what do you mean? What are you gonna do in 30 minutes? That's it. That's how long. If I was to get into a fight, that's how long the fight gonna last. See, that right now. See, 30 <laughs> minutes. See, this nigga think he gonna be fighting. Got, <laughs> like, what the fuck? No, fucking <laughs> this MMA crazy. Like, Bruh, 400 push ups a day is crazy work. What are you doing that for? Shit. Dude, that's a good, a good hour. That's a good workout. A good hour. That's it. Know, nigga I vibing be... like he go check the internet, make sure he got a, he ain't got a warrant to go do push up. Let <laughs> <laughs> me get a four hundred in real quick. I mean, it be three hours, but I do an hour weight training and I do like an hour and a half walk. You feel me? Put on my headphones, listen to my podcasts, write Only me some nigga questions. That's fucking with you right now is Gunner. Yeah, you and Gunner on the race. Yeah, that's my boy. Y'all look like and everything. Right? I ain't gonna lie, he he be wearing this shirt too. Yeah, that's why I, said that. <laughs> I seen that boy had that shit. I was like, oh boy, when I go to New York, I'm going to that store. Yeah. I seen that boy transformation too, though. He looked yeah. different. He looked healthy. Now. But nigga, yeah. he was in jail for a damn near year with no drug. Never. Yeah, you think true. a nigga gonna look? But like? he's still eating good. You feel me? On uh, every time I interview, God I see damn, that boy he eating straight. Look healthy. Fruit salads. Oh, look healthy. Yeah. <laughs> that boy got a belly, <laughs> a face <laughs> with meat in it. <laughs> Shit. Y'all boys ducking the question though. What? When you moving them in? When you moving them in? What's the right time? What's the right time to move a girl in? Yo, perspective. Now, I ain't living with nobody until I gotta live with them. So that's my law. So that means marriage. <laughs> Damn. I didn't live with a girl before. I mean, it's cool and scrape, but I like my own privacy. So I ain't doing that again until I get married. I'm so saying, you, what if you got a big enough house though? You that got ain't your about that. Nah, it's <laughs> about. Yeah, ain't about that. <laughs> ain't about. It don't matter how big the space is. It's mine. I don't give a damn. It's four by four. My personal. It's my personal space. Hey. <laughs> so until I get married, that's so all the time. I, I, I kind of agree with him too. Like I ain't really into the moving in shit. Like I can pick I and choose married. whether I want to lay in the middle of the bed, on the right, on the left, downstairs. I can pick if I want to watch First Forty Eight or Forensic Files. You feel me? Y'all I ain't got to watch Bad Girls Club. Same house. Y'all two stay with a y'all two stay with a woman before? Yeah. I did. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. I say I wouldn't. I wouldn't move nobody in until I see. I see the bad. But that's the. I, I feel like that's the only mm, way you I see the bad. To, I, need, I need to see the bad. No, yeah. no, nah, nah. Hell, nah, hell, nah. take a hell. Because it's, it's, it's certain. It's certain side. shit that's non-negotiable, and she do that shit while she already in the house. It's yeah. too late. Nah, it's too late. Yeah. 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 I want to see. I want to see. The, I want to see how you act when you're angry. Mm-hmm. That's all. I want to see how you act when you're broke. When you're broke, mm-hmm. take yep. a hell. You know. I want to see how you act away. when shit ain't when shit going tough. Mm-hmm. Bad days at work. Bad days, you know, just just other just other shit before you know you make that move. But that's a that's a big jump, boy. That's a big move, there, boy. Big, big responsibility big right there, my boy. So my two K reason wasn't good enough. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> <Hell nah. laughs> that's that type of shit you fuck around and move in, regret. get married, regret it. Then you got to d- get a divorce and you got to get her the house. I moved this motherfucker in my shit. <laughs> yeah, Not this her shit. Shit, you got a house. I'm gone. New you house. Every, yeah, new house. No house. JP, what you say? What's your answer? What's the right time to move a girl in? Oh, it probably ain't or no just time. to, to no stay time. together. It's a feel for me. Like I'm, I'm big on intuition. I gotta mm-hmm. see, I gotta see some real solid movement out of you. Like 
I gotta hear, yeah, boy, I seen your girl, boy. She be turning niggas down. She saying your name. Like I gotta see something Solid. that make me feel That's like. That's it. Nah, I'm, <laughs> I'm, 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 easy, man. I'm, I'm, these I'm, girls I'm, right, man. I'm, niggas will fuck anything, man. <laughs> no, I'm I'm just, you funny. <laughs> it gotta, it, it gotta be a feel like that. Shit gotta feel like home when you do pull up. Like them days you spent the night. Like mm-hmm. what's the vibe? Like is you working? I'm working. We doing our thing. We coming and we talking. Do it feel like home? Do it or do it feel like me and you? Do it but feel see, like us? Everything you just name is the good. The yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. What about the bad? Of course you want to do stuff when it's good. For mm-hmm. sure. For sure. It's when it's bad. Hmm. That's when you get the real. That's when you get when the real person. They way. You they never know. You, you never know paragraphs. who you're dealing with until shit goes south. For sure, for sure. That's who you really got. Yeah. That's mm-hmm. who you really moving in. So that take a t- that take time to me, dog. You got to be around exact, somebody. Exactly right. You got to be around for <laughs> years. Take years or exposure. Like if you spend a lot of time with somebody every day, then it kind of speed up that mm-hmm. time. But if yeah. y'all like dating on Saturdays and Wednesdays, y'all mm-hmm. see each other. It, it's gonna take time, time or exposure. Yeah. All right, all right. That's why I be telling people you need to date a girl for about a year before you even call yourself being in a relationship. I, I oh, say yeah, that, sure. bro, but I ain't gonna lie. Three hundred six five eight. Like pussy power would be kind of. <coughs> yeah. they, they'd be negotiating different for a lot of dudes. Yeah, because <laughs> shit, niggas ain't used to it. Never. Enough. Hey, what's one thing you feel like you could eat every single day? Oh man, you are. I know you're gonna say McDonald's. <laughs> I know you're gonna you know say I mean? McDonald's. Yeah, I know you're gonna say McDonald's. But that's what I eat, every day, anyway. that's what I eat every, every day anyway. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> McDonald's got the five dollar meal. Yeah. Going up. Me, a cybo. What is that? Cybo. Yeah. Okay. Every cybo. day? What is that? What's that? I see how like, like it's like a fruit bowl and it's kind of like a yogurt at the bottom. Get your vegan ass out of here, man. You eat so healthy. No, I ain't gonna lie though, bro. You eat so healthy, bro. And you so muscled up, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. A nigga, one hit, a nigga probably knocked your ass out. Bro. You so, you so hey, healthy, bro. Hey, you too healthy. You like a pillow. Hey, you know the funny thing is, right? I was walking this morning. That boy come say, I ain't gonna lie, bro. You getting a little too big, bro. Don't be mad if a nigga pulled a fire up. Nigga ain't gonna fight you. Nigga ain't gonna fight you. You too fit, right? Now. Like, you need to tone that shit down a little bit. Bro, she was saying the push ups, bro. Nigga eating you, bro. right and shit. Bro, I, I said the same I like, shit. I like, that for my, I like that for my brother, bro, dog. Before, I was like, yo, you ain't swole. I was like, nigga, you ain't shit. Nah, yeah. you gonna put out the sleeveless shirt? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you yeah. swole, nah, nigga, bro. Yogurts with, with nuts and berries and shit. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. got it, bro. Got All right, go. Every day. Nigga, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> <laughs> nigga probably shit smell like Febreze or some shit. Paprika. Nigga shit probably smell like seasoning or some shit. Blueberry mocha. A smoothie or some shit. What the fuck is over there? Nigga healthy as hell. What you know about the matcha? Yeah, the matcha. I need that blueberry need the matcha, matcha every What would it be for you though? Nah, though, bro. I ain't gonna lie, though. Chocolate nah, cookies. I really eat McDonald's, bro, like probably like seven days out of the week, right? I'll probably eat about five. I, go, I don't know though. I, I it don't really food, be though. too much to eat because like certain shit do your do stomachs a certain way. It just be make you feel a certain way. Like when I eat McDonald's, bro, I don't be sleepy. <clears throat> but when I eat all that restaurant with all that Longhorn and all that, man, I be dry yeah, to the world. Yeah, mm-hmm. I eat Mac, much. I be up. I be ready to sell out. Because <laughs> <Boy, laughs> they ass all that damn salt. <laughs> Boy, that ass around right here tripping. Yeah. Blood pressure, <laughs> blood pressure <laughs> high as fuck. <laughs> But if I was to eat healthy though, I probably what I eat probably like a um if I say if I want to eat a healthy day, I eat I mean I drink one of them um Kobe Bryant drinks. What them shits called? The energy body armor. Body armors. Boom. And I be eating salmon salad. Okay. I get that from mm, Yeah, I like that. What that place is. It's by McDonald's too. Smoothie bar? Smoothie bar. Yeah, I ain't mm-hmm. like that shit pretty good. Shit like pretty good. Stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I got a side bowl in the fridge. That's all so, I'm hey, so about. Chad, what's your go-to McDonald's meal? Number one, extra cheese, coke with no ice. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> That's a big Yeah. No or sometimes, like, sometimes, boom, with my old lady, I get the number seven, right? You know, number seven, a two cheeseburger meal. Yeah. Two cheeseburgers. Boom. So me and her, we'll split a cheeseburger. That real? Okay. That's like a little date night. That's a good <laughs> it's a little date that's night. A little, nah, it's a little nah, date night. Real really? shit. Well, hey, look, that's one meal though. Nah, that's cool. It's one that's meal. Good that's one, one meal, meal, but you get two burgers. But one fry and a soda. Who yeah. get the fry? We it's a large a, we fry. Get a large fry. You get a large fry. Damn. You don't we need all the fries. We share a fry. 
One hey, drink, you shout out, man. You, you, you y'all split the drink. No, I said this man shout out, bro. You can't get an extra fry. You like McDonald's onions? Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like that? Onions on the Big Mac, yeah. Yeah, but they gotta be chopped up. Yeah, they supposed to be chopped up. Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, I don't want them thick, man. <laughs> chopped up. I ain't gonna lie, man. I got a question. We asked this on the last episode. This is my last question. You feel me? Run it. But seeing how like frugal you are, right? You got kids. Yeah. Five, so thirty-seven. You said what? Thirty-seven. No. You got thirty-seven kids. Yeah. Nigga ain't got thirty. <laughs> <laughs> you worse than Dangalang. Dangalang. <laughs> Nick Cannon. What his name is from the city? Got all them kids. Oh, yeah. um, Johnny, Mr. Johnny, Johnny, Mac Johnny, Daddy, Johnny Mac like that. Daddy, man. Yeah, he got from the city. Hell yeah! Nah, he got the judge kids. told him stop having kids. If you keep having kids, he's gonna lock them up. Yeah, oh, so you said you come back with one more kid, we gonna arrest you. All right, go ahead. <laughs> all, right. <laughs> all right, but um, seeing that you are so frugal. Remember, we were talking about this. Um, how do you prevent your kids from being spoiled? You feel me? Like, mm. you have the access to, like, all right, when it's get to that time, like, they got to get their own apartment. Like, it kind of don't make sense to have an apartment. You could you probably invest into a house, a duplex for them to stay in, but they're not appreciative of it. Or, you feel me? They got a car. They getting into accidents, got your insurance high. See, all my kids grown, though. Okay. So, I got kids at Arizona State. One already graduated. Mm-hmm. I got two in college. High school. Mm-hmm. So I'm already at that stage, though. Mm-hmm. So the parents, mamas, mamas did a fucking hell of a job. Okay, facts. Mamas did a hell of a job leading up to that point before we even got to that stage. Okay. I obviously didn't understand the value of a goddamn dollar. And I'm your last option. Facts. I'm your, I'm your, la- I'm your last option. So you got to be doing something. I'm always supporting, every, I'm always supporting everything that you do. Mm-hmm. But your daddy is your last option. That's wrong. And you got to work. Cause I'm I'm not supporting. I'm not helping you out if you ain't doing nothing. Told yeah. y'all, man. I'm like, not I helping. Like I'm, I'm not helping out man. if you're not doing nothing. You got to be fucking doing, doing something. 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 I don't care what it is. Damn, you be a goddamn garbage. You, you, you be a goddamn garbage man. I got you. Yeah. You showing me effort. You even you, for you your daughter. Got, you got you got to be doing something. Looking for business. Her mama don't play that shit. Yeah. Mama don't play that shit. Oh no. All right. What if what if they doing something that's not say you don't approve of like bringing in bare minimum. Yeah, you feel me? Because we had that conversation. Like, they, what if they chasing their dream and they've been chasing their dream for four or five years? It's not really working out. It's not being financially responsible, but it's really their passion. Would you still support it? Yeah, yeah. It got to make sense though. Mm-hmm. I need to. What's your, what's your, like, what's all right, your, what's, 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 what's your long term goal and what you what you chasing though? What are you trying to be a rapper? What are one trying to be we a makeup artist? No motherfucking rappers. We ain't got no rappers. You feel me? We ain't got that. Not makeup. Yeah. Oh, I'm pouring into that. Makeup. Yeah, that's oh a, yeah, I'm pouring. I'm pouring into that. Right right that. Right Matter of right fact, my daughter, when she at school at Prairie View A and M, you know, one of her little side hustles is doing people makeup on campus. Okay, facts. Yeah, I'm pouring into that. Now that's something she want to take serious. You know, once she done with school, oh bitch, let's get let's roll now. I think Same. girls got a lot more side hustles than men do. Legal, legally, yes. I, I think we women have can too. do makeup, eyelashes, hair, a lot hair, hair a lot of, I do, I do all that. Yeah, I heard you do yeah, cosmetology. Yeah, I, do all that, right? I, was, right? Listen, I, I went to school. I went to, I went to cosmetology school for four years to prevent me from having a from four years. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Whatever school, <laughs> when I was in college, Damn, I took take that long. You got to think now. <laughs> When I was in college, they always had a cosmetology class. Yeah. So I always took one. Yeah. So I would think, boom, how do I save money? What do women always need? They always mm-hmm. need their hair done. Mm-hmm. They always need their nails done. Makeup. They need they all that stuff. I do all that. Looks. Wigs, installs, braids. <laughs> it's been nah, crazy. Mo- 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 you know how to braid? I, I, mean, I do everything. Bro. I ain't spending nothing. Crazy, mm-hmm. This man funny, though. Ain't nah, crazy. Ain't, no, ain't no joke. Bro, you know how much money I done saved over the years? I believe that real. What? Shit. You know, you dating people, especially here in Miami. Oh, I need 300 for my hair. No, you don't, bitch. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> no, you come don't. on, come over here. Come I got on, you. Got to oversee. I got you. I, I, can, I can do your install. I can break what you want. Pigtails, come on, we'll be here for a few hours. Yeah. <laughs> I do all that now. Man, Makeup the, too, man. The first time they said they seen you say that, everybody had like something to say. But I was like, dog, y'all liked it when Tupac did it on um, what's that show he had with Jenny Jackson? He had the daughter. He was there with his daughter only oh, doing it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like everybody loved it. Then why y'all like yeah, they don't, they don't, it? I mean, most most people won't understand, but I don't. But I don't, I don't play. Yeah, I don't play. No, 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 sir, no, sir. All so right. you could do makeup. Yeah, boy. 
I mean, see, I, be, I be beating my old lady face, boy. <laughs> he be yeah. putting makeup on him. Yeah, you know yeah. what she? Oh my bad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. Up for that. Y'all she know just, how they go clip. <laughs> just, you know, she just f- finished filming another Netflix series, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And boom, she had me. So the money recycled right back in the house. That's crazy, oh. right? Oh yeah, That's I need money for the way. makeup artist. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, I'm saying no. Nah, no, that, that's, that's the, the budget. budget. Yeah, that's yeah, the budget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For, yeah. But the budget keep, and keep the budget right here. Yeah. So I made that little. I made that little change. Yeah. Stop playing. Shit. Yeah. Need an assistant. That Black Wall Street right He's there. He said need an assistant. That Black Wall Street thinking right now. <laughs> real prep. Oh look, you need look. You trying? Yeah. You trying to lie? Look, that's the money at. Nah, cause not real shit. though. what? What can a man do besides go be a barber? Like dealing with it. So I'm gonna keep it, and I'm learning this, bro. But tech. Uh, pharmaceut- pharmaceuticals. Mm-hmm. That's how everything got to go to college for, though. Yeah. yeah. Now you well, don't. I'm talking about they hustles, have, like, the, the, out the dorm. Cosmo- out the- I'm telling you, cosmetology. For a man, is barbering. That's what I That's mean. it? That's, but you can do it. Mm-hmm. That's the only thing is we a, do. It's a program just like cosmetology. T- t- cosmetology. You can do it. Yeah. And um, what is it? It's, it's the health industry, it's the tech industry, and it's the beauty industry. Beauty you tech, going around help. what I'm talking about though. I'm saying side hustles off the back end, ain't got to go to no class, just off the strength, off yeah, the muscle. Just knowing what to do. Just knowing what to do. Cooking. Girls have that, bro. Men don't have that. Men <laughs> go sell to drugs. DJ. That, like, oh, okay, we can sell drugs, we could DJ, we could cut hair. Yeah, I'm talking about them shit. Uh, yeah, you yeah, feel me? yeah, you could yeah, DJ. DJ is DJ. not like a fucking hustle that, that you gonna get booked right away for. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't say that. You got to hustle. have a name to DJ, bro. No, no. you got to build nobody your... nobody hiring just no DJ because you, you DJ. You think yes, every DJ just came no, out and had a name? Bro. Why? Why is it that? Why do y'all feel like that when it's only fucking four DJs down here? Nah, we got a homeboy. Got DJ. A I got true. a homeboy that DJ. He, he we, so, we watched him start DJing. Hey, hey, the hey. little parties y'all talking about? No. I'm not talking about that. Hey, look, money, so, so, I, I come from the lineage of the ghetto style DJs. I, I understand what you talking about. I'm, 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 I watch. I've never seen you DJ at a party. But girl, you know you met. You've never been booked for a party. Bet it. Bet it. Where have I you been booked to, for I used to party? do radio, 919, 917. You nine, did nine, radio stuff? I did everything. I didn't do it when I came up top because I ain't had the luxury of having a radio station and DJ equipment. Ghetto style DJs, Patch. I was, we was kids DJing. But at the I Miami never heard Arena. a nigga walk up to you and say, "Damn, bro, we DJ again." You, but you but if fuck I, that boy, you ain't known for DJ. But when I'm in the city, when I'm down south, I am. Up top, I'm not. All right, you a DJ. He said, you a DJ. Nah, DJ I ain't JP. DJ nah, we just let you know, bro. I'm it's, just saying, like, bro, you nigga can, is not going to wake up and be like, oh, damn, I'm finna be a DJ. Yeah, bro, we watched somebody do it. In the comments, man, y'all y'all, y'all know what to do. I was saying, we, we watched our homeboy do it, you feel me? Now he get booked for baby showers, all that. It's, mm-hmm. it's a side hustle. We ain't saying make the most money. We just said side hustle. It's, 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 Same we, way they get paid for uh, some braids. Like, they, they don't be making it. It's knowledge to what side hustles are. And we, yeah. we The knowledge we get on side hustles is usually robbing, stealing, and yeah. Insane. You know what I'm saying? That's fast way. That's fast. It, that's it. And that's what we mm-hmm. want, fast way. Yep. But there's other stuff out there to get you. I ain't know, I ain't know barbers get paid how they get paid. Yeah, barbers, oh, get, barbers get paid. Hey, that's a good question. Look, what's the average price for a haircut? Now? I used Shit, to pay yeah. $10 for a haircut back in the day. <laughs> Shout out to Mr. 250. I don't even, I cut my own hair now. <laughs> <laughs> I had a barber, he was Jamaican. That boy used to, that boy was fly before I knew what fly was. Yeah. That boy used to, nah, you wildin'. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Dog, he he he, uh, nah, <laughs> you can have that. Man, you know Gary, uh, bro. I'm good though. I know who Gary is, but I'm good. <laughs> His name was Jensen. Mm-hmm. He was Jamaican. That boy used to wear Laguna Beach jeans. Like I'm in white town. Like when I used to be, I was like, "What this nigga got?" I'm trying, trying to get money like this nigga. Like, damn, this nigga fly. Yeah, this this nigga fly. get money. My hell fly. So I ran into one of the barbers that used to be working at the barber shop while he was working there. Like at a Dollar General over there somewhere. So I said, damn, bro, what happened to Jensen? Man, you ain't heard about Jensen? Jensen got deported. Kilos, Jamaican. <laughs> I'm like, God damn, that's how this nigga was fly. <laughs> so you saying they don't make money like that? I mean, I'm just saying, like, barbers is, like, a good job. Like, it's like a... So how much... Wait, I just realized. How, 
you kind of went away from the question. How much do you pay for a cut? Yeah. Back then, cuts used to be $10. What, what, what yeah, you cut right was now? cheap back then, boy. Used to be $10. Yeah, what you pay for it now? Well, you only getting a tape, so about. I don't, I don't even do nothing. My $15, head. $20 just just for a tape money. right now. He said, all I do is get money. I ain't gonna lie, I don't know how much of my. A cut is like $30 now, $40. I yeah. really don't know how much. I pay him between $60 to $100, depending on how good he cut my ass. Bro, and that's crazy, but it's. Chad ain't getting no cut. I got my clippers at the eye. Yeah, I really. How much you charge for a cut? Oh, nah, I'm cutting. Bro, I learned. I learned how to. Nah. I learned how to do it myself. I fuck your hairline up. That nigga looking for you. Yeah. That nigga looking for you. That man crazy, dog. Oh man, man. Yeah, nah, they were charging like 15, 20 for a tape. But barbers though. be having money though. You ain't never that's the barber give you change. They pull out that shit. They ain't yeah. never got change. Bro, that's, that's you feel me? It's consistent. No, consistent money. money I'm a habitual pocket watcher, bro. I said, yo, I gotta I wait in line. Habitual pocket. Yeah, I gotta I'll wait in line. I was like, boy, that boy got he cut two. Right? He cut like two heads <laughs> in an hour just now. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then me. Okay, I know I tip good too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh no, that boy just that boy be coming like up. Five hundred and twenty hours. What are you doing? That's cool, bro. As long as I get a little VIP treatment. Nah, yeah. niggas will make you get up. Quavo walk through the door. Nah, mm -hmm. I, I don't think Is so. Is you getting up? That's the thing. Say if you getting a cut, right? And a millionaire walk through the building, right? And he get a cut from your ball. Mm -hmm. And you already in the chair. You getting up? No. Hell no. And he tapped his shoulder like. He <laughs> 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 be tapping his shoulder though, like. <laughs> look, look, you already look, look, look how Chad look at that. Look, <laughs> boy. Good, boy. You don't finish cutting my hair, goddamn. Yeah, right. oh, so you ain't getting that niggas? What? No. Bro, what? They're gonna be our last time in that chair. You hear how much I said I pay for my cuts, bro. Hey, you bro. know this one cut. I'm here every other week. That boy dropping a band for his cut. And he gonna shop. pay, he ain't gonna pay for your cut if you wait. Oh, you pay? Nah, he gotta pay for more than my cut. He got a little cushion. Yeah, you out here. Yeah, look cushion. I ain't asking for a thousand dollars. Hey, bro. Yeah, yeah, Fifty dollars. I ain't getting up. Y'all getting up. On man. everything I ain't getting If he had up. already started on my head and it's dead. I'm get up and do push-ups. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, hey, bro, stop playing with me. For real, <laughs> stop playing with me. Mm -hmm. Nah, y'all got any other questions before I'm getting get up, up out of here? I'm like, shit, I, I just, I, I knew, I seen you was coming. Nah. <laughs> Hell nah. Nah, man, I just... We all appreciate you pulling up. Back. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I love the yeah, fact that people get to see y all got the me real the you. Motherfucking highs, man. Yeah, man. You <laughs> yeah, probably man. be flossed on the crew. The only one that could get Ocho out the house past his bedtime, man. Appreciate <laughs> you for coming through Most here. Most definitely. Most yeah. definitely. Oh, definitely. Yeah, man. So y'all already know what to do, man. Make sure y'all like, subscribe. Like and subscribe, pussy ho. Stop playing, man. <laughs> pussy ho. That's our new drop right there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good drop. Good drop. Hey, bro, when the last time you gave them the address to the... They ain't sent nothing to the address in a minute, nah. Oh, the, the P.O. Box? box? Yeah. Don't worry, we gonna insert that this episode. You don't know that, man. Off this <laughs> <laughs> Too fucked <laughs> up. Yeah. Thank y'all, y'all. Come again. He just paid the rent on that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I paid pay that bitch up for two years. We good. Yeah. Just send it through. Yeah. Going to 2413 Main Street, Suite 200, Miramar, Florida, 33025. Anything y'all want to send, come yeah. through. I hope that's right. But yeah, man. <laughs> Make sure y'all like, subscribe, follow the Instagram, Flystone the three hundred five. You want to let them know one more time where they find you, or this you already know. Man, they better know. They right. better know, man. Hit up Shit. Ocho Cinco at Ocho Cinco. You heard? Max, mm -hmm. follow my dog too, man. You yeah, heard? man. We try to get his followers up, man. Make yeah, sure y'all give me up, man. Give me up. Give me up. Give me up. <laughs> appreciate but, you. Appreciate you, man. Yes, we'll holla at y'all next week. Oh, love. We out. Yes, Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Smoke some, bitch.